the number of employees of a company decreased from 225 to 189. Now notice that is a decrease. Find this percent decrease. To do so, first let's find the actual employee decrease, number of employees decreased by. To do so, remember we had 225 and then it decreased to 189. Now I'll let you subtract. If you subtract, you'll have 36. That's the actual decrease in number of employees. Now I want to know percent decrease. So that actual decrease is what percent of the original employees. So the decrease we just found, which is 36, that decrease is what percent, that's what we're looking for, so we'll let that be x of, how does of translate? Of translates here to multiplication, original employees. Now remember, originally we had 225 and then it decreased to 189, so the original number is 225. Now, remember this is understanding, this is translating to an equation. Now let's actually solve this equation for x. To solve this for x, I will divide both sides, because this is multiplication, I'll divide both sides by the coefficient of x, which is 225. So I have 30, Six is equal to x times 225. On the right side, I divide by 225. On the left side, I divide by 225. Now, what do I have left on the right side? I have simply x because the 225s divide out. Now, I'll let you divide 225 into 36. If you do so, you'll have 0 decimal point 0.16. Now we want this as a percent. How do you write this as a percent? You move the decimal point two places to the right and attach a percent symbol. So two places to the right, that is 16 percent. So the decrease here is 16 percent. Now, how can you check? Well, find 16 percent of 225, subtract it from 225, and you should have that 189. So the decrease is 16 percent.